Uh, my name is Marcus Clark, I come from Nottingham. I'm a Nottingham based puppet um, company called Hands Up Puppets. Uh, we've been based here for 25 years. It's a company I set up with my girlfriend and now wife, Helena Smee. Hands Up Puppets is not all that we do. Um, Helen is certainly an established animation scriptwriter. Um, but our work with Hands Up Puppets, even today, uh, within the art of puppetry, is the basis of everything that we do do. Um, Masterclass still. I will be doing that occasionally. <laughs> uh, now this lecture is called uh, Puppetry for Screen Masterclass. And I have a film that I made for the Kids BAFTA website that's called Puppetry for the Screen Masterclass. So I'll be showing you that and hopefully that will give you a good grounding. Uh, then I'm going to tell you a little bit about me, a little bit more about me, uh, about how I started in show business. I come from Nottingham, so uh, I come from the provinces for a better description. How I progressed to become a West End Theatre stage manager. Uh, how I then got into puppetry and uh, into working in film and television and all over the world, how that happened. Uh, it's a bit of uh, practical first-hand industry insight, I suppose. And how that journey, the uh, journey that I've taken, has meant that I've had to learn lots of different skills. Lots of different skills. And how that's grown me into being many forms now of a creative artist. So today, I'm a, uh, a performer, um, CV image, a <coughs> professional puppeteer, a performance artist, an artiste, for want of a better description. I've even done stand-up comedy with puppets. Uh, that's my CV, handsuppuppets.com. Um, puppet making image, <coughs> how I became a puppet maker. Uh, again, a little bit by accident, how I needed to do that. And from that became a product designer and uh, a craft maker. There you go, that's our puppet making page. Uh, Softies image. How I uh, became a scriptwriter. A TV series divisor, a producer. I co devised this series, uh, Softies, uh, for Channel 5. And I've even been BAFTA nominated for my script editing work. <laughs> which is quite funny because I've got CSE English, <laughs> which is less than a GCSE. And I, I think I only just scraped the past. Um, <laughs> um, how I became a digital artist and a filmmaker, I made this, uh, I made this website, and I've been making that for about 10 years. And uh, it's as websites go, it's, uh, I code it and everything. Um, I've become a filmmaker, I made the uh, Kids BAFTA film that I'm going to be showing you. I also made a film called Clay Film House, which is a short, with puppets, with... Um, but in the process of my puppetry, I ended up having to make this film and edit it, and I became an effective filmmaker. I'm a fashion designer. This is one of mine. That's come out of my puppet making. I've moved my puppet making craft, because I get a bit bored, uh, into puppetising jackets. There's a very good reason and story for that. If you go to four puppetised jackets, you'll see initially I did it... Um, I, I did it because I had nothing... I had to go to the bathrooms, and uh, I had nothing to wear, and I couldn't afford... I didn't want to really spend 500 quid on a DJ or a red one. So I decided to puppetise this jacket, give me something to wear. Um, and then from that came out a whole uh, <coughs> fashion type thing where I moved my puppet making into uh, men's clothing, effectively. I haven't done any ladies clothing. Um, puppet TV graffiti image, a contemporary artist. I've again moved my craft making into contemporary art from one of the great descriptions. And I often describe myself as having always been an artist, and, and this is a self-portrait I made. And as you can see, it's made out of, I've, I've drawn it, obviously, as a self-portrait. But I've also used a lot of puppet making craft materials in there. And uh, it's very good for my sanity, I enjoy doing that, and I exhibit. And uh, I've also become a teacher, 
just about to qualify. Uh, teacher image. <laughs> I'm enjoying this, this is great, but I must start talking about puppets, I appreciate that. Um, this is my uh, teaching page. Uh, I do a soft puppet making workshop. I've, I've developed lots of different workshops. And uh, I suppose the important thing about all of these things is that uh, I, I, I've, I've learned them out of necessity because I've had to. Because if you're going to be an artist for any length of time, short of just going and taking a straight away full time normal job or teaching job, then you find that you have to do a lot of things. And that's uh, a bit of a pain, but it's also a good, it's also a good thing because I find one, one thing informs the other. So I'm Um, I find one thing informs the other. These are some puppets we've just made for a, a theatre show that we've written myself and Helena because we're returning a little bit back to doing theatre. And um, you do something different and then I find it informs my film work. So without further ado, I'm going to show you my puppetry from the screen masterclass. Um, Is that the video I loaded up earlier? Yeah. You can run it from the DVD or you can run it from that one, yeah? Yeah. The screen. Practitioner. 